Hi there! Today we're going to talk about marketing dashboards. So we're going to explain what they are and recommend some marketing dashboard tools that you can use. At the end of the video, we're also going to share some tips if you want to create a marketing dashboard using Excel. A marketing dashboard is a visual and interactive tool that displays and analyzes key marketing metrics. They help track the performance of marketing efforts for any marketing department. Marketing dashboards provide real-time updates and easy-to-understand insights into many aspects of marketing performance. It allows decision makers to monitor and measure the effectiveness of their marketing strategies. It also helps them make data-driven decisions and optimize their marketing efforts for better results. So to explain it in different words, a marketing dashboard is a tool that summarizes your marketing metrics through interactive visual display and also gives you insights by analyzing those metrics. Now let's talk about some important aspects of a marketing dashboard. Number one is key performance indicators or KPIs. And these are the quantifiable metrics that a business sets to assess their progress towards strategic marketing goals. Examples of KPIs might include the number of maybe new generated leads, website traffic sources, click-through rates, customer acquisition costs, or customer lifetime value. You can decide which KPIs matter to you based on your customer journey and your marketing process. Number two is integration with data sources. A good marketing dashboard pulls in data from various sources, such as social media platforms, Google Analytics, your CRM software maybe, and email marketing platforms too. This provides a comprehensive view of marketing performance across all channels in one place. Number three is visual data representation. Now, this usually includes charts, graphs, and other visual aids that provide a clear, concise, and interactive overview of the data. This makes it easier to spot trends, compare different data points, and make informed decisions. Number four is real-time data tracking. The data on a marketing dashboard is often updated in real-time or near real-time. This provides the ability to monitor campaign performance and make adjustments on the go. Number five is customization. The dashboard can be customized to show data relevant to specific goals, channels, campaigns, or time periods. This allows marketers to focus on what's most important to them and change the KPIs according to the business priorities at any given moment. Number six is actionability. The ultimate purpose of a marketing dashboard is not just to present data, but to facilitate informed decision making. This means that the data should be presented in a way that highlights key insights and trends that can inform strategic decisions. By providing a clear picture of what's working and what's not, a marketing dashboard can help businesses optimize their marketing strategies, better allocate their resources, and ultimately improve their return on investment. So let's go through some examples of the marketing dashboards that are available out there. And number one is HubSpot. HubSpot's dashboard offers a comprehensive suite of tools for inbound marketing, and that includes includes SEO, content marketing, email marketing, social media, and analytics as well. It integrates well with other platforms and provides real-time data. It's also user-friendly and offers excellent customer support. The main downside to HubSpot is that the price can be quite high, especially for small businesses. The second marketing dashboard tool is Google Data Studio. Now, Google Data Studio is a free tool that allows you to visualize data from various Google services. That includes Google Analytics, Google Ads, and Google Search Console. It's highly customizable, supports real-time data, and allows for collaborative report editing. When it comes to the cons of Google Data, Data Studio, it has some sort of limitations when it comes to integrating with non-Google data resources. Additionally, some users find the interface less intuitive and it has a steeper learning curve compared to other dashboard tools. It's good to note that there are other more advanced tools out there like 
Tableau and Clipfolio. And that's in case you're looking for more advanced features and you have a team of data analysts who are ready to work on more complex tools. Excel can also be used to create a basic marketing dashboard. While it might not have the same level of real-time data integration or the sleek visual interface of dedicated dashboard tools, it is still a cost-effective and flexible tool that many marketers are already familiar with. To create a marketing dashboard using Excel, start by identifying the KPIs you want to track. These might include metrics like website traffic, lead generation, conversion rate, click-through rate, or social media engagement. Each KPI will need its own column in your Excel spreadsheet. The next step is to input the data for each of your KPIs into your spreadsheet. This could involve manually inputting the data or copying and pasting from another resource or even using Excel's data connection features to pull data from an external source. The third step is to decide on the time period you want to analyze for each KPI. This could be daily, weekly, monthly, and so on and so forth. You should have a column for the time period as well. Next, you should highlight the cells containing your data, then navigate to the Insert tab on Excel's ribbon. From there, you can choose to create a variety of charts or graphs that represent your data visually. These could include line charts for showing trends over time, bar graphs for comparing different categories, or pie charts for showing proportions. Arranging your charts and tables on the page is super important to create your dashboard. This might involve creating multiple sheets for different categories of KPIs. You also need to be sure to make your dashboard visually clear and easy to understand at a glance. Now, thank you very much for watching this video. We hope you now understand the concept of a marketing dashboard and that you're ready to apply that to your business. If you need any help, we're happy to help you. Just drop us a comment and we'll get back to you.